How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Fall 2005. Every month in Horizon 5 we get an update that includes features and more importantly cars. Lots of new to Forza cars that have been added to the game in the playlist for free every single month. Now usually us as players we don't really know what's coming most of the time. We, we know the theme in advance but the cars we're not always able to guess. However we do have an input on what cars get added to the game. Over on the suggestions hub which is where Playground Games direct players to suggest things for the game there is a car voting section where we can vote for whatever car we want to see added to the game. Now obviously Playground Games target the cars with the most votes. So what we're going to do in this video is have a look at what the top 20 cars are on the suggestions hub with the most votes. Very relatable actually over on Twitter this week Playground Games posted a graphic just quickly showing all of the cars that they have added since release and it's a lot. When you think about it all of these cars or at least 90% of them were added completely free of charge. If you find these videos interesting make sure to subscribe you won't miss any videos in the future to do with this, leaks, updates, anything Forza related. Let's jump into the list. Now we're actually going to do the top 22 cars because some of the top 20 have actually been added to the game because obviously they're adding the most popular cars. So we're actually going to start with the 22nd car rather than the 20th. So the 22nd highest voted car is the Ferrari 296 GTB. It has 563 total votes. Now it's a relatively new car, it was developed last year I believe. Now Playground Games don't always add cars straight away as soon as they are sort of in production. It takes a little bit of time for them to get the ball rolling with these new cars. The Ferrari 296 is definitely a probability. The 21st highest voted car is the Aston Martin Valkyrie. This has 573 votes, very close to that Ferrari. This I also think is slightly possible to be added, it's got loads of votes so obviously they're going to try and focus on it. What worries me though is it is quite a unique car, it might be quite hard for them to get their hands on, to scan and to get audio recordings from etc etc, but you never know, we might see it at some point. Now the 20th top voted car is actually a tie to the Aston Martin Valkyrie, it also has 573 votes. As of recording it's gained an extra vote and it is tying. So it is the Volkswagen Golf 2020 Mark 8 as you can see. This top, The topic in question covers all of the production variants of the Mark 8 including the hatchbacks and the estate body types, the GTE, the GTD, the GTI and the R types. The 19th top voted car is the Honda Civic from 1992 to 1995. This has 581 votes, these are all very close down towards the 20th slot, it's the top 10 which really have a lot of votes. It covers the coupe, the hatchback and the sedan, now this model has been in previous Forza games, more specifically Forza Motorsport 1 to Forza Motorsport 4, however nowadays it's nowhere to be seen, it's the 19th top voted car. The 18th top voted car is the Lamborghini Aventador from 2011 to 2022. Now this topic is for voting on Aventador named model that are not in Horizon 5 like the Roadsters and the Aventador LP 780 Ultime. So while the Aventador is in the game this is voting for other variants it has 583 votes it's the 18th highest voted car. The 17th top voted car with 592 votes is the Mazda Fiori. I genuinely don't know how to pronounce that. I hadn't even heard of this. This car has been in Forza Motorsport 3 and Forza Motorsport 4 before which does in my opinion increase the likelihood of these being brought back I guess. Now the 16th highest is the Ferrari Roma from 2020 with 627 votes. This is one of them cars that I'm surprised isn't already in the game. I'll be very surprised if they've not already got processes to add this. It may mean it's another six months, another year. God knows how much. They have so much going on in the background. Ferrari Roma, it's a normal Ferrari. It's in production. I don't see why we couldn't see that at some point. That is the 16th highest votist. The 15th is the Alfa Romeo Giulia with 698 votes. Now the interesting thing, the interesting thing about this one is Alfa Romeo is returning next month to Horizon 5. I think this is a certain possibility that it could be within the update so no need to talk more about that. That is very possibly coming next month 
698 votes. The 14th highest voted car is the Toyota Altezza 1998 to 2005 with 739 votes. Now this model has been in the game before. The 2004 Altezza RS200 is, was in Forza Motorsport 1 to Forza Motorsport 4. Again, if it's been in a Forza Motorsport game before, I personally think it's a little bit more likely to come back at some point in the future. The 13th highest voted car is the Lamborghini Huracan STO from 2020 with 748 votes. This car was added to the game a couple of months ago. We voted for it, it got high up on the list and they listened and they added it. So that is an example of the highest voting list working. The 12th highest voted car is the Fiat Multipler 1000 Tipler from 2022 with 783 votes. This topic is actually for the custom French Multipler project completed in 2022. Now this is a very high spec version of the Fiat Multipler which was one of the ugliest cars ever made as you can see on screen. Um, you can see the details about which specific car they're voting for the game. 783 people have voted for it. Unfortunately, I think this one is very unlikely. It's just a bit too unique, but you never know. It's high up on the list. The 11th most voted car is the Gumpert Apollo from 05 to 2012 with 790 votes. This covers the Apollo S, which is in Forza Motorsport 3, Forza Motorsport 4 and Horizon 1, and the Apollo Enraged, which appeared in Horizon 1 as well. This has been in previous Horizon games. I don't see why we couldn't maybe see it in the future Horizon games. We're into the top 10 now. The Maserati MC20 from 2020 with 825 votes. This is fairly similar to cars that are already in the game. It's just another similar variant, similar year. I don't see why we couldn't see this. The ninth highest voted car is the Toyota GR86 with 840 votes. Another example of one that worked, they added this car to the game in this most recent update. So once again, the highest voted cars are certainly being looked at. That one worked. The eighth highest voted car is the Toyota Chaser X100 from 96 to 2001 with 864 votes. This topic includes the Avant and the Tora versions. Now the seventh top voted car with 869 votes is the Lamborghini Sian. Yet again, another example of it working. We received this early this year, I think, around Christmas time. Now the sixth most voted car is the Bugatti Belide with 880 votes. Now this is a very unique car. I'd be very surprised if this came to the game, but Playground Games do often surprise us with the odd strange car that we don't really expect. So maybe we'll get that at some point. Now, fifth place, we're into the top five now with 800, sorry, 993 votes is a Koenigsegg Gemera. I would love to see this in the game. It is a stupidly high powered four seater hypercar i bet it's on their watch list it's in the top five with 900 votes now the fourth highest voted car is the mercedes amg gt from 2021 with 1012 votes now a very 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 similar car to this was added to the game just a few months ago so once again get voting your cars because that is three of these top 10 cars that have been added to the game eventually that is proof that they go off these highest voted cars into the top three now, we have the Toyota Yaris from 2020 with 1,217 votes. Voting on this topic will include the Japanese market GR Yaris, I'd love to see the GR Yaris, and the other trims and the other model as well, you can see the details on screen. I would love to see this in the game, we just got the GR86 which is very similar, but the, Yari, the GR Yaris, that would be sick to have in Horizon 5, or well, the Japanese market GR Yaris RS at least is what I'm on about. Now in the second place with 1,666 votes. A big jump up there is the Mercedes SLR McLaren from 04 to 13. This covers the hardtop, the roaster, the 722, the MSO McLaren edition and the SLR Sterling Moss which is my favourite. It's second place. I don't see why Playground Games wouldn't be looking into adding this car. It's high up there for a reason. Now in first place, the absolute most voted car to be added to Horizon 5 by the community with 3,833 votes, that's more than double second place, is the Nissan Tsuru. It is the Mexican market version of the third generation North American Nissan Sentra. 
Playground games would be stupid to not look into adding this. It's, as I said, it absolutely, it's almost got more votes than second, third, and fourth place combined. So why would they not be thinking about it? I would like to see it in the game. So there we have it. That is the top 20 highest voted cars. Now, if you're unhappy with the list you've received today from this video, obviously you need to get on the suggestion to do a bit of voting. You know, we all need to work together as a community to really bump up the cars that we really want. If only half of the community is voting for cars, then only half of the community is going to be accounted for. It's a collective effort. We've got to work together. And as you've seen, lots of the cars we talked about today are in Horizon 5. They've obviously been added after they've been voted for. It obviously works. Let me know in the comment section which ones would you really want to see in the game and which ones are you hoping goes up the tier list a little bit. Approaches the top 10 if it isn't already in there. Use the suggestion sub guys, it's so important. Leave a like if you've enjoyed and I'll see you all later.